Wednesday, May the 21st, day 11, and some of the skippers are facing the wildest wind so far in the race. The gales are heading towards a stricken PRB, and made skipper and then race leader Vincent Rieu abandoned ship. Loic Perron diverted to rescue him, and today sent this video of that rescue. Alors, bien au programme pour aujourd'hui, opération rescue. Nous allons récupérer notre ami Vincent Rieu, qui est juste devant nous là-bas, je l'aperçois. Il y a un problème de quille. Voilà qui grimpe dans son vide. Vincent Rio is still on board the leading boat, but now as a passenger with Louis Perron, the man who won the Musto Trophy, first past gate four south of Newfoundland. He's now waiting to see what time allowance the jury will award him for his detour to rescue Rio. And that decision could decide who wins the 2008 Artemis Transat. Top French sailor Jean-Luc Nelias, who's reporting for the race, predicts that the contest between Perron and Gitana Eti and second place Leclerc en Bretaire could be exceptionally close. Perron, the black boat on the graphic, was forced to the north when he rescued Rio. He's expected to have to tack. The Cliage further south, the red boat on the graphic, will be on the inside track with a better angle to the finish, sailing a shorter course to Boston. The boats may come together here, that could be on day 12, May the 22nd. Before they fine-tune tactics though, both skippers must get through a storm, as Armand Leclerc explained to Race Control today. My feeling is we forget the race during the next hours, uh, because uh, for me it's the uh, important thing is security and put the boat on uh, Boston, so to finish the race, so uh, during this uh, next hour, I prefer to be safe with the sails, with the boat, and after uh, the storm, I, I, uh, I start a new, a new race. In the class 40, Giovanni Soldini has tacked. He keeps himself between the fleet and the next mark, the ice gate. Behind 11th place, Simon Clark today spoke of a frightening mast climb to retrieve a jib halyard. When I started, I could see that this weather coming towards us and I knew but uh, if I didn't do it then, it was, you know, that's it. I was, wasn't going to be able to, I was just going to have a taste for the rest of the trip. So uh, I just piled up the rig. For latest position reports and race statistics, visit the race console 